Hi guys and welcome back to Morley Street. Today we have driven all the way to the west coast of Scotland, to just outside Oban, and we are at Dunstaffinis Castle. And we're going to take a wee look around here and see some cool stuff again. And if it's your first time watching this video and this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell, and that will keep you up to date with all of our videos. And we'll see you in there. just come out of the shop and <laughs> we're just about to walk up these stairs where Lucy nearly fell down. The stairs take you inside this beautiful place. Very very nice. Let's do it. So we've now reached the top. It's very windy and there's a beautiful beautiful gate. The guard chambers but you can't really see that's where a guard would have been sat in there for anybody coming in. And this was your way in through the front into the courtyard. Well. Bits here with windows in. So we can go up here without falling. All well, these lookout areas. And a nice wee building area would have been over there. The stairs to go up to castle walls. Awesome. More lookout areas that Molly's going to try. No, it's fine. It's fine. Beautiful view. So after Molly's been in, there's another bit there which is quite high. There must have been a floor to see out of because there's one there as well. Oh, they found one of the Easter eggs. What's this over here? Let's see what this is. Yeah, just a little bit. A giant well, maybe. Oh, yeah, it's a well. That would have been all the water. It's a big well. Place there and there, which means that it would have been the floor up, and then quite possibly another floor. The kitchen fireplace, that's the kitchen area down there. It's the kitchen area over there, it says kitchen fireplace. Yeah, and it actually does say, Well, I'm just clever. Well, well, yes, I'm just clever. Right, so we are now in the kitchen area up to where I was a minute ago, which was up there. And you've got the kitchen fireplace, which is here. And it's huge! Absolutely massive. I don't know, I'm standing inside of it, so... It's actually quite new. So that would have been your window for your second floor then, with a fireplace and the second floor. Okay, so when you come out of the kitchen, you've got this area, which I haven't found the sign yet. Uh, North Tower or Donjon. 
which I'll take you to that in a second. Leave it under the stairs, takes you to nowhere. And you've got this bit here. Stairs somewhere, which I'm assuming that that's not the stairs, but it might be. Awesome. And you come down into this area with some slightly newer stones. So these were put in clearly to make sure that it didn't fall. You as you as what? Stays up, so this would have been the tower that would have looked down into yeah, the view right into the water. Maybe any approaching ships from this area probably would have been much higher than what's left. It's been lovely to see it in its heyday. Way and see where them stairs take us. So, yeah, the gatehouse built in the 1500s, replacing an earlier entrance to the upper floor. I added a, a century later in the 17th century. The inner gate arch was blocked in order to form a cell inside. Twist it and open it. Mommy, make sure you look at the eggs. Oh, nice. Lovely view. It's got a big cast iron fire surround, and that's probably what would have been here when you know, this was in use many, many moons ago. Funny business was going on. Right, nobody was causing a ruckus. And out this window, we get a view of the back garden area and the water. Very, very nice. And we found another egg. Although this is a newer staircase, these bars here. Probably, we're probably here when the staircase was originally. Would have probably been for some sort of carpet, maybe, or a tiny window out into the well. Now into this room. It's still got more, more modern-y fireplace with a, a small surround. to possibly the castle wall where they would go out and have a wee patrol and again a nice view of the courtyard again to keep an eye on everybody make sure nobody's up to anything so this place had two fireplaces this room so it was either one complete room or Separate into two camels. In 1469, James III granted the leadership to Lorne and the captain 
Chelsea to of Duns Daffinage to Colin Campbell. We've come out of the door to where I said that he would come out and or they would have come out and had a look around. Hey, hold on. The uh, wind's blowing that much and it hold my hat on. And lovely view of the water. Absolutely beautiful. And you can come all the way round where they would have seen the courtyard area. So, whee! That was windy again. And more of the water lock area. Down to the front garden area. You probably would have had your troops based for anything into the woods for the campfires. Along where a nice view of the old kitchen building and the tower. You've also got a tower in this corner. You probably would have housed another lookout station. Sign guys, and see what the sign says. The great oh, so this, this tells you the wall. That? what everything was. So you've got all these numbers here from one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. And this is what they all are. I can't read it out to you guys because I'd be here all day. That's uh, got a big head. That's my body. <laughs> That's the sign. The wind has slightly calmed down a little bit, so you might be able to hear me now. But absolutely beautiful view of the hills over there in the background. The hills and rolling hills over this way and out across the water to the other side. Uh, which there is a bridge now down there. There wouldn't have been a bridge back in there. This actual wall is in this, this wall here that's in 3.5 metres thick. Yeah. It's crazy. It's a, and you think it goes from from there? All the way through <laughs> down there. So if you were if you were living in these quarters, it probably would have been something uh, quite special and high up. Uh, and over this way, it actually tells you what is across the water and surroundings. Having a field day. We don't have to do it. 
Because they want. Because they want. Because they live on our roof. And I'm going to lose my hat. I really am going to lose my hat. Right, let's go back inside and head up the stairs. <laughs> yeah. This one is actually an even smaller staircase with a handrail and tiny, tiny. So this is a loft. <laughs> the tiles on the roof. There's actually no fireplace up here, so you probably would have been heated up from the walls. There's another view of the courtyard. And the three, three windows. Yeah. A view of the water. Mum has found the golden egg. Yeah. <laughs> Easy. Easy. <laughs> so those us thinking it actually wasn't the golden egg and mum found it. Well done, yeah. Mum. Well done. Right, let's continue back down these stairs. So we Yeah. Well, if he doesn't believe us, I've got a video to prove it. Yeah. Hey guys, remember to watch your head when you come through that door. Let's us back down to the captain's quarters. You know, for it being the captain's quarters, um, surprised that it only had the one, the one fireplace. Uh, yeah, it might have been a fireplace, it might have been a door, because it did actually say on the sign outside that it was blocked up, the hall outside to make. No, because I can't see nothing out there anyway. Oh no, you'll put your flashlight on. I don't need to put my flashlight on. Outside and have a look around the grounds, and if there's anything interesting, we will let you know. But that's going to be the end of this one. And if you enjoyed that video, make sure you give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button as well, and that notification bell, and that'll keep you up to date with all of our videos. And we will all catch you in the next one. See you later, on, guys. Oh, oh, oh.